So, hej då alla och välkomna till Great Yai Sama. Jag vill säga att det var en bra episod i Sampai. Det här episoden var väldigt bra episod. Holy shit, man! I mean, one of the reasons why we love the Great Yai is because she's a great Kurugan, right? Kurugan demon, even better. Because yeah, she's a very, you know, edgy, sexy Kurugan, scantily clad Kurugan, if anything, right? But awesome. And yeah, check. Check out Sampa episode 9, it was constantly like Natsumi's oppa is being shown. <laughs> like half the episode was like, you know, Kuruga Natsumi's oppa. That was like, seriously half the episode. So I'm very, very, I feel, uh, I say it, ready right for some Yai oppa too here. Yeah, some, some turn oppa right. Uh, but, that being said, I guess it's gonna be some kind of fighting with Angelic Saura or something? Yeah, like she... Uh, okay, so I think definitely that whatever gave them powers, right, magic or so on, is God or whatever, right, the typical heaven. Um, it, but it looks like a demon lord, so it's probably her sister, right? I'm thinking it's her twin sister, kind of like in Supernatural or whatever. Um, that you have like God, uh, which is, you know, like the good or the light version, right? And you have the evil thing, right, the evil then, but you know, you have the dark one. Because she is the embodiment of the mad crystal, right, so she's probably... The embodiment of heaven then, and all the ones embodied with the hell, right? That's why they're like twins or something. That's what she looks like, the demon lord, because they're probably, you know, sisters, right? One good, one evil, or whatever. If, of course, necessarily demons aren't evil. But dark and light, right? There. Light and darkness. Probably so. But anyway, she, I guess she buffed her up because she was like, actually a super nice person, yeah. But I, I, I love this episode. I love that how it ended because the last bit, right? It felt like I used a one-hour joke. It was like, oh, she's happy. Oh, I'm happy an old lady. Oh, I'm doing so much evil. It felt like a very, you know, like a basic joke. And suddenly it's like, you you, you, you get angelic powers because you're so nice girl. So it actually turned out to be a interesting plot event there. But anyway, let's have watching it. So three, two, one, and go. Yeah, so here we go. She gets the powers. Exactly, which I guess God gives her like a nearly powers, right? Yeah, turns her into like an angel instead. So instead of going from becoming an angel falling to heaven, she actually becoming an, an angel. It would be kind of fun if she gets into like a magic girl. If she, she becomes Silly Moon too, it would be kind of fun if she has her own magic girl outfit. But I don't think so. I, think she, I don't think she's gonna... Yeah, exactly. I guess correctly. She's just gonna... I mean, she gets like a white uniform instead, but... Yeah, like a light to the form of, of her demon uniform. But let's see, still be probably to, maybe, maybe she's finally gonna fight Yaya, right? Because now she's like, I have to... Oh, but she's much stronger now. Yeah, yeah. She's like, blessed up by the goddess, right? So maybe finally now she can fight Yaya, interesting. Yeah, because I mean, obviously, Yaya is not she's sister, right? <laughs> so, <laughs> gimme, 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 gimme. Yeah, so maybe finally the great Yaya can finally fight, right? Uh, but as I said, the episode when Yaya defeated the Mary Girl, Yaya is actually a very good fighter. I think that was kind of funny, right? Because obviously, Yaya seems to be completely incompetent. Tomorrow, it was something else. It's going to be completely crazy, the useless, right? But she actually fought her with, with magic powers after the beast episode. She was actually very, very competent. So maybe Yaya actually did win because. For some reason, Yai is actually a really good fighter. She, she actually has enough magical power, right? That we, which you wouldn't believe, but we have seen it before, right? Um, but yeah, you do see her giving the power here in the opening, right? Uh, the the goddess, I guess, is... Because she looks like a demon lord in the opening, but I guess, as I, as I said, I think it's a twin sister, right? The heavenly twin sister. It's a common open story. Um, but anyway, yeah, I saw it in the last stream too, but yeah, so around it later, and usual, half an hour later here. I just slept, okay? Uh, yesterday I found up a kettlebell that I ordered on Black Friday. I trained with that uh, earlier today. And then I, I don't know, took like a cat nap and I woke up just like a half an hour ago. <laughs> See, death, I mean, he's a god, right? Give me a push. But yeah, I just kind of woke up. Uh, <laughs> Cause I was like, oh yeah, anime. No, I was like, I don't know. I guess I was really tired. I hadn't slept that much this week and did some exercise and then I just collapsed or something. Uh, something like that. Because I was like, oh, where am I? It was kind of like, honestly, yeah, in, in my, I was like, oh, what, what happened? Kind of like that, right? Nice. Something, some yai ass. Nice. That's what I'm here for, baby. Oh, they're finally gonna meet her! She's finally gonna confront yai! I have tried to kill you for years! Yeah, she's like, who are you? It's like, we're finally gonna fight you, yai! I love it. She's finally gonna confront her. She's like, oh, I've never met you before. 
Exactly. Yeah, it's like, I have no idea who you are. <laughs> it's like, she's finally gonna... Exactly. Dare? Huh? Dare? I've never seen you before in my life. I've never met you. Yeah, of course. I never met you. Yeah, for Jai is like, I've never seen you in my life before. Because Jai never knows her, right? Jai, she was not saying in the background. I was like, no, no. <laughs> Oh, that's true. Yeah, I mean, not as a kid, but as a, yeah, as a kid, but uh, you know, not as you know, not as big. <laughs> you were the kid. <laughs> what a coincidence! <laughs> yeah. How have you been? <laughs> but not as Yaya, core. Not, not as Yaya, right? She never noticed her. Yeah, look at my cook. <laughs> look at my new polish. <laughs> See how stronger I am. <laughs> Yeah, you're a hentai, I get it. You're a, you're a weird woman, yeah. You're basically naked, but, ah, yeah. <laughs> I love it. She's gonna piss her off, is that? You're gonna fight, you're gonna piss her off, you're gonna mentally break her. Yes. Well, <laughs> I knew it. Oh, that is so obvious. Don't tell me anything, okay? I'm gonna, I'm gonna figure out who you are, yeah. My rival that ever? Someone from the demon world that I never tried. <laughs> yeah, that's right! That's right! Remember me, please, the great Sarva! I said the wrong thing, of course. <laughs> Dare! I like to see one immediately. <laughs> she had to fight her. Yeah, of course, uh, Jan had to fight her. She used mentally broke her stuff without having to fight her. Yeah, she never even noticed me! Of course she did! That was obvious, she never noticed her. Damn you, Yayi! Exactly. <laughs> Damn you, Yayi! Yeah, I'm Sarva! Finally, yeah, uh, fight me! Shobu! Are you crying? <laughs> I'M NOT CRYING! <laughs> okay, so yeah, yeah. But I guess she's a lot stronger than Ara. She's a demon blessed with angel powers. Oh, I like a holy katana. Yeah. She actually might be stronger than right? Because it's... No, she's like an angel demon. Is she turning... Is she really turning command? I don't know. <laughs> Is that her own title? I'm turning command. Like, that's really what she was. Yeah, you're a magic girl! You're a traitor! <laughs> it would be kind of funny to turn into a magic girl and turn into like a Sailor Moon character. It would be kind of funny, but yeah. Defeat me, I will tell you, right, I guess. So yeah, you're finally in trouble here. Cuts with the light katana, yeah. Maybe not. There's no blood yet. Yeah, you're taking it. Whoa! Yai! There's no blood though, but she can't freaking kill the great Yai. Doesn't hurt at all. Something. Doesn't hurt, yeah. She's she completely stabbed her. She she penetrated her. She was like, oh yeah, you you you, you, you fixed my injuries. So somehow the light can't hurt people? What, what this is? I guess so. Yeah, f what? <laughs> of course this anime is just so stupid. The li light magic can't hurt you or something. <laughs> yeah. Whack, 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 bam! What is this? Yeah, it doesn't hurt you. It's just it's pathetic. It's just like, you sit there with, with, oh, turn off the light katana. It's like, it's a lightsaber with no damage. What is this thing? Yeah. You felt that? I don't know. It felt great. What's wrong with this lighting? But I feel so powerful! Yeah, what's wrong with the lighting? But I feel I'm a ten times stronger than I usually am. Yeah, oh yeah, you improved my... Uh... <laughs> Could you just punch her with a normal fist though? You just punch her with... Yeah, it's all shitty. Yeah, he's a glowing, he's like a cute... Yeah, what have new clothes to for? 
But I didn't see like fist like the sword, I just punched her. I just punched her the number of fists, right? <laughs> Poor Sarva. Oh, she's gonna cry now. Of course she is. Yeah, it's like, oh, sorry. I didn't mean to be immune to your damage. I turned it hurt a lot. <laughs> it's just how powerful I am. <laughs> of course, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's so sad, funny. Yeah, it's like, oh, it really hurts. I'm, I'm just so powerful. You, you, you just can't hurt me because I'm the strongest, you know. Exactly. It's just like, that, listen to me. Uh, I'm just so powerful that you just can't hurt me. That, that's just how it is. Yeah. Uh, you did your best, though. <laughs> Poor Sarva. Oh my God, that is. God, oh, that is. Yeah, don't run away. I'm trying to be your friend. Ah, uh, Lucy's going light power immediately. Can she follow the light, maybe? Like it's flying up in the sky, right? Follow it. <laughs> but why could she punch her for? It, it felt like she was much physically stronger. Why don't she just punch her, right? Oh, poor Sarma. Finally confronted the Yagi and then she got. She healed her instead. Now she knows my name at least! <laughs> yeah. Daddy! It's a great success! <laughs> God damn it. Great success in my life, yeah. Now she knows my name. I have. Um, yeah, I, 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 I have improved the situation here. She knows who I am. Oh, Kukuro Shan! Kukuro! She's ignoring you. What is it? Ignoring the great Yagi. Kokoro! <gasps> oh, she's sad, what's happening? Maybe her mom is like, you can't be friends with the Yagi anymore. She's a weirdo, she's a hentai. Yeah. What's happening? Little Kokoro ignore Yagi. Yeah. Her only really friend, right? Ha <laughs> <laughs> lady! Man, I can't just stop thinking about Maria's titties now in, uh, in Vampire. Well, save was later. Holy shit, there were big titties. Last, uh, yeah, the oppies were everywhere last uh, Monday there. Um, Nan Maria showing her oppies, yeah. <laughs> As expected, she hates you. <laughs> Who doesn't hate you, yeah? It's like, come on. She's my best friend. She's my only friend, really, right? Yeah, come on. She's my, my Tumulashi. Huh? Huh? Yeah, she's mine. She's mine. Huh? Here we go. Don't she? Yeah, this is my tumor does she? Yeah, she admires me. She's my true best friend. Come on. She's the only... Yeah, she's my only best friend. Come on. Maybe let her help her out if it's sad for her. Yeah, she's, like, she's the only one that understands me. Yeah, she's the only one that understands me and likes me for who I am. No, she didn't have, didn't have a fight. <laughs> you and your sister just all the time. They're like, let me you discuss who has the best, <laughs> who has the best boobs or so on. <laughs> That's right, my sister is a stupid, oh, my stupid girl. <laughs> like, yeah. Exactly. That's what's happening. <laughs> this doesn't feel like necessarily Kokoro is like angry about bus size though. <laughs> I don't think Kokoro is angry that uh, Yai was like, my titties are so much bigger than your titties. Yeah, I don't feel that was a thing. That's more a landlady and owner uh, thing. How can you even hurt Kokoro? Exactly, I would never hurt Kokoro. <laughs> you see how her. You finally have friends and you come to me for advice! Oh, I love you, Yagi! Yeah, instead of helping her, it's like, oh, I'm so happy. But I feel something a bit different, right? Yeah, 
I feel you're kind of putting it on the eye and it's just the wrong, but with Kokoro, I feel like it could be something else, like her mom or something, right? Maybe her, maybe she heard that the eye is a weird hentai. Yeah. Yeah, Gamba too. Okay, Owen just gives her like a Gamba red speech. He's like, believe in yourself, Yai. Um, here she is. Kokoro! Because Kokoro is more guilty, right? She's like, she's like sad that she can't be friends with anymore. Man, this is sad now. This is sad now, yeah. Come on, Kokoro! This is sad now. Yeah, this is like super sad now. No, it's, it's Yai's fault, right? She's like, no, you would never hurt me. I love you, Yai. Yeah, see, this is getting super sad now. Yeah. Losing Kokoro. Losing her heart. Too much candy, Kokoro. You got a sickness. Yeah, Toshiro's her only friend, right? Come on, poor Yayi. Kokushi just told her that she was a uh, Asobo. But I mean, her cavity sounds like. I don't think you can, like. Yeah, it's like I have a hole in my teeth or something. Yeah, I don't know. Sounds like she has you know, eaten too much can or something. Yeah, I don't know, Kokoro. If that's like something you can give someone else, you know. Well, I mean, it depends. It's just, of course, she could have something that is contagious, but. I mean, it could be contagious, right? But uh, seems kind of weird, yeah. I don't know what she has. Sean. She's like up from the demon world. Who's like ghost there? <laughs> now, I wonder if Yai believes in ghosts. She's like, I'm a demon. Who's a living ghost? Or oh, she's like, go for idiots. Yeah. No, of course she's like, for ghosts and for idiots. <laughs> like, something that exists. Ghosts can exist. I knew it, yeah, the guy is gonna be like, pfft, ghost of idiots. This is this a ghost. Demon is one thing, but yeah. Ah, oh, freaking knew it. Of course, yeah, you won't believe in ghosts, right? We don't make any sense because she's a demon, but yeah. Okay, so there are ghosts. I mean, it could definitely be um, the light, right? Yeah, it sounds like the light, of course. It's coming up here, giving people powers. Yeah. It's a goddess light thing, right? It definitely sounds like the light. I'm <laughs> not scary at all. Like, oh my god, what if Yai gets lightened? Yeah, what if Yai is living next door to the goddess? But if it's really Yai, it wouldn't believe in ghost right? Because, like, you know, <laughs> she's a demon, yeah. But the demon world, like, they can't be ghosts aren't real. It's like, you know, <laughs> unless if she knows that ghosts aren't real for real. Maybe she knows that if you die, you become a demon or whatever, right? Maybe she knows that, no, no, you, you get into it, turn into either heaven or hell or something. But I doubt that Yai actually knows shit's right. But it could be that Yai actually knows how what I have with a dead soul, right? But I very much doubt that. Exactly, you can like maybe she can sense them as well. Here we go. Are ghosts real? <laughs> Are ghosts real, Yai Sama? Yeah, 
Yeah, it does feel like the demon. No, second in command demon shouldn't be afraid of a ghost. It should be like, I am the second strongest demon in the universe. Yeah, it does feel like it should be like, I can defeat you. I'm a demon. I'm like, a, you know, like an orc demon kind of girl, right? <laughs> God damn it, guy. You just transform and fight it. It shouldn't be that hard for you. Exactly, trying to scare me. Stupid landlady. It's always Lenin's fault. Stupid landlady. <gasps> Stupid ghost! Hmm. Maybe we should go over to the next room, right? Go over to the neighbor uh, apartment. <laughs> Rats away, he said. No, but it's a light, right? Yeah, it is a light, of course. But, uh, maybe, you know, see, it looks like a demon lord, right? It's like it's a horde and everything. It's a demon lord, like a sister. It's a twin, clearly. But what if it, uh, yeah, what if it likes uh, Yaya, we do think? Like a purified Yaya. Yaya with light powers. Yeah, exactly. So it just takes everyone? But if it's Sado, it's like, you're a good girl, right? But now it's like, it gives everyone power. It's like a random, it's like random generator. Everyone gets powers. Now it's just kind of random, he's giving anyone powers? Okay, yeah, he's like, no, I'm afraid of you. Hmm. No, it's a light, goddammit, yeah, it's a light, it's a magical girl light. This is Christ, yeah, you have to know it's a light. Yeah, let's fight! Demon Lord. It's gonna be saved by her love interest, right? The Demon Lord. You know, her true love interest, of course. Maybe... Drudge? Pretty kind of random, but okay, why not? Could I have one of her demons appearing, right? Drudge-chan! Yeah, I can't show her my weakness. Drudge appeared, okay, why not, I guess? But I felt the Demon Lord might appear, right? Yeah. Could be kind of cool to see them actually teaming up though. If she says force now, they can fight together, right? Yes. They never cross my mind. <laughs> She's so stupid. I never even thought about that. Like, God damn it, guy. Guy is so stupid. Holy shit, you stupid guy. Oh, you knew you were definitely up to something, guy. Like, yes. Uh, <laughs> like, but, um, yeah, what if she can actually team up now with Drudge? Actually, it could be a cool fight this episode here. Of course, it's ending now, right? But what if they team up their demon powers and fight her? That's good, Yai. I want to be a pro proper demon lord, you know, kind of thing. Yeah, let's let's fight together. <laughs> and Drudge is always so happy. Yeah, she's always so satisfied with me. Yeah, there we go. Let's transform. Let's go, girl. Team up. Here we go. Yeah, let's be transformed. Let me get my oppas out. There we go. Let's fight. Yeah, this time I will rely on you. Okay, just for this time though. Yes! Yai sama! <laughs> now, that's a kind of nice ending here, yeah. Let's do it, Yai sama! Exactly, let's team up! Okay, it's a good ending, yeah. We can fight the god together. Okay, it's a good ending. <laughs> she's like, what? You gonna fight me? <laughs> I love it. She's like, oh, I don't wanna fight you guys. Okay, she's like, no, I'm a weakling. No, don't fight me. <laughs> of course, for some reason, she's like, just throw the magic against but Yeah, don't fight me. No, I don't wanna fight. I love that. Yeah, she gets afraid of them immediately. It's like, no, 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 I don't wanna fight. I'm sorry. Yeah, okay, so for some reason, she's afraid of them. Oh my god. Yeah, I love this last bit here, and he's standing confronting her, and she's like, No, 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 he's not uh, holding, no. Huh? No? No? <laughs> Leave me alone! So, um, it needs to be really weird, right? Like, he can p give people powers, but as we saw with Sarva, the power seems to be useless. Yeah, like, you can't actually hurt anyone. So I guess she can't actually fight too much. She's like, uh, actually, don't fight me, please. <laughs> yeah. Here comes the god, the heaven, or whatever she's right. Yeah. 
The Divine Realm, whatever she is. And <laughs> but I love it a lot. This is a cool angle. I, I hope for it. Yeah. Left bit here, and they're like, let's fight her together. Yeah, like they're teaming up there. Showing the true force, right? Um, the Druid's, Druid's dream, right? The final baby Jai. Uh, but certainly felt weird, but poor Sarva was like stabbing her, and it was like nothing happened. <laughs> wacky, wacky! She's like, oh, why doesn't he do 200 damage? Uh, oh my god, this, this first she was amazing, man. Yeah, and Yagi is like, oh yeah, it's it's like, uh, it, it, he's on my wounds. Let go, you keep going. <laughs> Do more. <laughs> he's going to do damage. Um, oh my god, this anime. This anime is, is always so, it definitely is like a special kind of combat, right? Uh, I can really see some people, but I mean, I love this kind of comedy. I really do, right? This is exactly, I keep saying, you know, it's, it's Scott the Gladys and what it's straight down in, in my kind of uh, rapper or of, of comedy, right? I can really see some people hating it, though, yeah, certainly, because it's like, it's a lot of laughing at people crying and so on, yeah. Sarva is like, oh, fuck me, do shit, yeah, it's a lot of that, right? Laughing at her misery. Uh, but, but I think it's just so fun, you know, how. Not only is Sarva failing, as always, uh, but also how, uh, of course, Yagi is like, after, of course, Sarva tried to kill her for a few minutes, so you would think that Yagi would hate to right, try to kill her, but then Yagi is like, Oh, I, I am in pain! Don't worry, girl! You you do you definitely hurt me! Like, oh, it's so much pain in my neck! Oh, oh, you stabbed me? Uh, it really hurts now after. I'm just so powerful! Like, <laughs> yeah, because that's something you sorry for her, right? Cause then of course she's like, but I got this like white uh, uh, coat and everything, and you know, and then yeah, he's like, oh, oh, it must be all my medical games, you know. I'm so powerful, you can't hurt me. <laughs> yeah, it's. Uh, but that, that's what I mean. That the comedy for me is, is hilarious. But I guess a lot of people hating it certainly. But I mean, we had episode. Uh, we got it. We almost am now, right? So if you're here with me now, you probably of course love it. Right? Uh, but definitely it's a spe special kind of anime, right? Special kind of comedy, because first we're laughing at Sarva crying, and then, and then, but then I think it's hilarious how Yagi goes from like, yeah, let's fight to death, into like, oh, uh, 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 oh, oh, my stomach, you stabbed me, oh, I'm so much in pain, you know? <laughs> like she's pretending to be in pain, and like, oh no, it's just that I'm, you know, Sarva Shan, I'm, I'm, I'm the demon, second in command demon, I'm so strong. You, you have to understand how powerful I am. It's not your fault that you can't hurt me, it's actually, it's my fault that I'm so, I'm so strong. You did your best, you know, <laughs> and she's like trying to just, uh, yeah, just trying to tell her that, oh, I still love you, you don't worry, girl, yeah, like, I, I respect you. Uh, yeah, well, wow, that's beautiful, <laughs> and then of course she started crying more then. Oh, that poor girl, no, she stabbed her there. But I love the whole, I mean, oh, of course, as we all knew, like, there's no way that she ever, you know, knew how she was, right? Yeah, Dari! And it's all like, yeah, mentally, men, basically, yeah, I already won immediately by mentally breaking her. I never heard about you before. Sarva, I have tried to kill you every episode. It's like, oh, I've never seen you before. <laughs> uh, but the, yeah, she did meet her as a kid, of course. She didn't remember that, but <laughs> I have never noticed her attempts on her life, right? But, I mean, Think about she actually most of the time she never even noticed she tried to kill her right like with the dog and so on because it actually never really affected Yai right uh, but the trap though it actually is true though that Yai did note the trap of course because she kept avoiding traps right Yai kept avoiding the traps where of course Mad Girl kept going into them and being like save me Yai she's like no no I won't save you ah save me pig pig save me yeah she kept doing that right so it, it is true she actually has noticed. Um, I mean, she has noticed, how to say it, her, her presence, right, to speak, in that sense. She hasn't actually been completely ignoring it, but of course she never, didn't actually see, uh, <laughs> she didn't actually see Sarva, right? She just saw, um, yeah, like her traps and so on. So it's not entirely, <laughs> are you crying? <laughs> it's like, I'm not crying! <laughs> like, but, but yeah, she actually did stab her. She actually got her in, but yeah, did zero damage. Uh... <laughs> but I like how Yaya, of course, is acting like. Uh, for, I mean, for the first moment she was like, no, no, she keeps hitting me, right? And then it's like, oh, it actually doesn't hurt, yeah. Like, <laughs> oh, it's something wrong with my keyboard. Oh, sorry. It's something that happened earlier today, too. So, what happened with my keyboard, it's pretty really clear, is that the, the, the space button is seemingly triggered by itself sometimes. 
So of course when I now I freeze this frame right to go in rewrite, but then the space button, if it's not a button, for some reason triggers. Super annoying. So I was writing the description of uh, the senpai, uh, annoying. My senpai is annoying. You kept adding like a space uh, per letter. I don't know what's happening. It's really weird. Um, I tried to play it in earlier, it didn't help. Maybe a reboot. But but anyway, yeah, so no no but anyway, I'm just, I'm just <laughs> reflecting here, but it explains why because earlier when I was doing the Sampai review as well and I was like pausing a screen, right? It started suddenly the screen started uh, moving again and I wanna get, you know, some issues I, I, I it's one thing if if you if you play like a full screen moving right, then there's a huge chance you might get you know, if you're unlucky, right? But if you like pause it like this uh, for doing anime or so on, uh, it is much, much safer. I mean, it, it's not entirely safe, but this is much safer, right? Like, like a freeze frame, yeah. It doesn't mean you're immune to get issues on, you know, on your channel, but it, it's much, much safer, right? Like, it's 10 times as safe, uh, but still not not entirely, right? Of course, unfortunately. Uh, but anyway, if you're unlucky now, then it might start autoplaying. It happened earlier, but that's because my, my keyboard is like sometimes giving random space button, but the space button, of course, is uh, out to play right so if i press space now it's gonna play right so that's really strange but anyway i'm just i'm just uh, throwing out some um, uh, no but I, i'm the kind of guy right that it comes from sorry for this <laughs> rant now but it comes from i think a lot of working as an engineer right uh, i work as a design engineer uh, mixture of you know creativity but also engineering uh, and being an engineer in that in that fathom right you always think about this stuff it's like why this is breaking right you're always thinking like okay i'm gonna apply this formula i'm gonna build a bridge okay why isn't it working right so currently i'm working with i can't say exactly what i'm doing because of all this nda stuff, right but currently i'm working with this huge system with several hundred people involved and it affects millions of people every day right so it's a huge project and of course sometimes or a lot of times right i find some issues right some bugs or whatever you can point right and you have to be like, okay, why is this happening for it? So that, that's why I'm almost like, okay, why did it out to play earlier? Okay, now I get it because my keyboard is, is is sending out space input for some reason. Okay, so it's like a it's like a random input. If I touch the keyboard now, any button it seems to also send space button. Right? So as I do this thing, it's fine. But if I press the A button now, it's gonna be A and space for whatever reason. Right? So super annoying. But so now I have basically, you know, I I I haven't solved it yet, but at least I know how to not accidentally play it now, right, like I did in the last stream. Uh, so that's why my brain is like, okay, here's an issue. Uh, I located, you know, what was happening right. I haven't come up with a solution yet. Uh, maybe I fortunately had to get a new keyboard, but you know, at least I have like the broken down uh, the steps, right. Uh, but honestly, it would be annoying because I have a very expensive keyboard. It's still actually it's only one year old though, so it's still probably in the but I have like a machine uh, silver lean keyboard, right? So it's like a super heavy keyboard, um, which means I can, uh, it's super sensitive. So I can write very fast and just a, just a very high, you know, sound effect, right? When I write, right? Good uh, vis uh, audio feedback. But anyway, yeah, she stabbed Yagi and for a moment I was like, oh, Yagi's gonna have actually injuries. And then immediately it's like, no, 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 it didn't even hurt me. <laughs> then I said, really for yeah. Bad to review, yeah, and she was like, it didn't even hurt me. <laughs> but that's kind of how I felt, honestly. Like, it was like too easy, right, for Sarva. So, for the first month, I was like, what? But then, of course, immediately, like, actually, no, no, it's too easy for her. Like, it's gonna be something that Yai is immune to it or whatever, yeah. Like, it, it kind of felt like that. After the initial first five shock seconds, you're like, wait, actually, wait a minute. Yai is gonna be fine, right? Because this is too easy for Sarva. Uh, she, went, she went in there and really got Yai. No, no, no. For, because, I mean, certainly Yagi is usually it's not a winner. Uh, certainly in this anime, Yagi usually is a loser, right? As with the Kokoro storyline. I mean, certainly I mean, it turned out good for Yagi in the end. But, I mean, a lot of the anime is about Yagi, you know, being a miserable loser, right? But while Yagi is a miserable loser, you know who's a bigger miserable loser? You know what I'm coming to. You're like, yeah, while Yagi is a miserable loser... There's another girl that is even a bigger Mr. B. Loser in this anime. Um, and that is, of course, the great <laughs> Sarva. That's all like, but I did this stuff and yeah, I'm not crying. And yeah, I mean, of course, there's a one other girl that's an even bigger loser than her, right? I'm not a loser. And yeah, what did I get my cloak for? It sucks as a one. Yeah, oh, here it is. I find this, you know, crying. 
Det är svart och Det är helt det, det är svart och Det är det. Det är But it's not even big illusion, right? A lot of the comments I mentioned earlier in this anime definitely I see some people hating this anime, right? Because this, this, this is probably the episode I think the most has been focusing on laughing at people crying, right? Yeah. Uh, so again, right? Kokoro and the Yai part of someone, that was like laughing at Yai crying. But the Sarva part, that was real laughing at Sarva crying. I'm not crying! <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I mean, I love this anime, but yeah, certainly this, this episode pushed push this kind of comedy to the max, right? Where half the episode is like Sarva crying, right? Yeah, it's like, I'm not crying! I'm not useless! Stupid guy! Stupid light chick! You should do anything! Um, but yeah, but, but I think it's very fair to say, right? That this anime is all about, it's a lot about, uh, you know, laughing at the misery of Yai and so on. But again, you know, <laughs> Sarva's misery is even grander, yeah. While Yaji has a lot of mysteries, Sarva's mystery is always bigger, right? So yeah, that, that's very true. Uh, but anyway, why doesn't hurt them? I'm going to guess my point here, I'm going to guess my last point here, and, and guess what's happening. So, Sarva certainly felt a lot stronger. Sarva's like, I'm stronger, I can jump, I can fly, and so on, yeah. And obviously the magic girl is very, very powerful. So, as I kept saying, the reaction part, you just, you just hit her, right? Yeah. I think the issue is, and when the magic girl is very powerful, and it's very threatening to them, right? Uh, the issue I think is pretty straightforward. The light magic makes you stronger. It definitely does. It makes you like beef up, right? yeah. But it only gives you physical strength. Right? The actual light magic itself is used in a fight, as you saw with with Sarva, because it's like holy light magic. Like, it actually it, it can hurt you. Normally, I think in most animes, light magic is very very powerful in most games, right? But in this anime here, apparently the light magic just just makes you better, right? And actually, it makes sense because dark magic is of course gives you like misfortune, right? Makes you unlucky, makes you physical, so on. Humans are like, oh no, my back hurts. Oh, I have back pain, you know, like the like the owner, right? Uh, and big opas, yeah. So obviously, dark magic gives you like misfortune. Light magic just gives you fortune, right? So cutting someone with a light sword, it's just like healing them. Yeah, it's like, oh, oh, yeah, it fixed my back pain, right? Yeah. So that's the issue, right? Light magic can't hurt you because it just, it just heals you. Yeah, it just gives you benefits, right? Uh, however, though. Getting this like angelic light magic inside of your body, like getting like, an angel buff, gives you a lot more strength, right? Because this empowers your body, like you get like a level up, right? You get to 10 times more levels. So, Magic Girl could defeat them early on, so on because she was like fighting them, like with her strength, right? she's quite a physical, crazy girl, right? She's, she's like a masochist, sadist, right? She likes to fight people, so on, yeah. Uh, if Sarva had just punched her, as I kept saying, if, Sa if, if, if Sarva had just punched her in the face, right? Just, you know, went for the physical strength. She actually might uh, have damaged her, right? But the actual light, the pure light magic is completely pointless as a weapon, right? It's just a healing thing. It's better you stabbing yourself, yeah. I mean, it actually isn't pointless because you can, of course, stab yourself with a katana to heal yourself, yeah. Because it's like a healing katana, right? So if you stab yourself and, and fought the eye, you actually could have won, right? But the actual light magic, of course, is just the opposite of dark magic. Dark magic is anime. Just gives you bad luck, right? And you and you get like back pain and so on. So of course, light magic is gonna give you good luck and heal your back pain, right? I mean, it, it makes sense to think about. Uh, but certainly, then it, Sarah was stronger. She said, "I'm I'm stronger. I'm faster. Like my level is higher, right? Yeah. So it, it definitely gave her like a level boost, right? But she didn't actually try to use, you know, kick or punch Jai. So that actually probably would have worked, right? Still, Jai must still have won, of course. But like that would have been much more effective right? if you actually just punch her. Instead of just like cutting her with a healing magic, <laughs> but yeah, and that's also probably why the why the goddess has to give people powers because she can't actually fight herself, right? Because she's just pure light magic. She can, she can only give them like you know happiness, right? Yeah, she can't actually hurt anyone. And after you think about it, that's why she can't of course defeat Rudy and Jai. She's like, oh, don't fight me because she as by herself, she's just like good luck thing, right? Yeah, like she's like, oh, don't fight me, guys. I can't actually hurt anyone. Yeah. She probably can't actually hurt anyone, right? That, it actually makes perfect sense in that sense. I'm thinking about it. Um, but anyway, guys, uh, I'll just get the episode. And I think my theory in the end there is, is perfectly makes sense, right? I, I, I say so, yeah. Like, light magic is just purely positive in this world. In this anime, light magic is just, um, yeah, it's just, just a buff, right? It just, uh, just makes you stronger. <laughs> so, a light magic katana is, of course, just a healing katana. Uh, but if she hurt herself with it, you know, if she cut herself with the katana, she would probably just get stronger, right? Or just heal herself. So, <laughs> but when I think about it, the healing katana, the light katana isn't useless. You have to use, use it on yourself. Yeah, you have to use it on your own body. Because if anything, 
you also probably get stronger too, right? It, it heals your injuries, right? So, and, and it also probably fixes your issues. So it, it actually probably makes you stronger and also heals you. So yeah, kept pun <laughs> kept fighting Yai and kept healing separate. Like a pad. It would be much more effective. <laughs> but anyway, see you guys and have a great day.